certainly entitled to request protection at that level from the National Guard, I agree. But let's face it, the National Guard is a massive, cumbersome organization. Sure, that's what we need, a presence. On the contrary, the people want protection, they need protection, but they don't want to see protection. It frightens them. Having the National Guard on every corner will keep the peace, but at what cost? They'll get over it, Julian. In the end, the thing they'll remember is that the National Guard is cheap. I'm dealing with taxpayers here. The last thing I need is another fiscal accountability scandal. Hmm. What? Come on, I want to show you something. That executive. He probably has the daily access algorithm for the displaced central servers stored on his laptop. Lambert gave me pretty strict non-lethal parameters. If you stay close, you should be able to hack into his laptop wirelessly. I'll give it a whirl. So, what did you want to show me? In the lobby of the Empire State Building, there are four brass rondelles, our deco pieces. Each rondelle represents one of the four disciplines of skyscraper construction. What? Good work, Sam. Now you'll be able to access the central server on the first floor. Conk this wireless stuff makes life a lot easier. Yep. Welcome to the Wi-Fi era. Remember, you're saying that to a guy from the era of Hi-Fi. Hi-Fi? As in, like, high in fiber? <sighs> Don't put me in adult undergarments yet, kid. So... Well, you're worried about the cost, huh? You're worried about what the taxpayer will think. But it's a mistake to think that those two things are fundamentally tied together. The stairs are cheaper than elevators, Tom. Why don't we have stairs as the fourth discipline of skyscraper construction? No one is gonna take the stairs up 70 stories. And does anyone ever question how much an elevator costs? Of course not. Right. And I'll tell you why. Because the cost of an elevator isn't measured by what you get. It's measured by what you avoid. This place is expensive, Tom. I mean, there's no denying that. But it's not important how much it costs to hire us. What's important is how much it costs not to hire us. A bunch of good old boys from the Appalachians with M4s in every street corner. I mean, yeah, sure, it'll get the job done. But in the end, relying on the National Guard is like taking the stairs. If you want to keep those five million executives going to work every day, hmm. well, you maybe got a point there. Of course, I have a point. Let's go talk to my. Sam, each of Displace's different divisions seem to have their own server farm. I put a program on your OPSAT that will build a little backdoor into their networks. You want me to upload that to each division server? 
I would appreciate it. Since you asked so nice. Good work, Sam. That's the first of their servers. If you can upload that to each of the other ones, I'll be able to snoop around as much as I please. I'll see what I can do. NASA just reported the astronauts on the ISS got their life support back online. So they're gonna make it? Well, probably not. But at least they have time to attempt the rescue. The shuttle? Yeah, NASA is working to repair the rocket assembly. They think they might be able to launch in time. What about the Chinese rescue? I guess we don't need them anymore. Hmm. Well, here's hoping nothing else goes wrong. Sam. Upload that program to the last server and you'll make me the happiest girl in the world. You're easy to please. Access is a girl's best friend. It's a pretty cushy posting, that's for sure. But I heard the guy was really annoying. The guy isn't there anymore. He's out of town. What, so you're just watching his stuff? <laughs> yeah, emptying his liquor cabinet and playing video games. He's got the new Prince of Persia. Yeah, I heard it's awesome. Gonna be game of the year, man. Can't wait to play it.
Thanks, Sam. That's the last one. I can't wait to sniff around and displace his laundry basket. Uh... What? Laundry. I totally forgot. Shunted the data we need off the server. Log in name M. Nedich. Mylon Nedich? That name is coming up an awful lot, but we still don't have anything on him. Probably a pseudonym. I'll see if I can find out who he really is. In any case, we need to get access to his computer. His office should be on the upper floor somewhere. Uh, sorry to interrupt, but. I see it. Power's coming back on. I see it, Grim. You got company. You might want to. I see it. I want to check the server and make sure nothing got fried when the power came back on. Okay. Give a shout if you need anything. Will do. some creepy stuff about Mylon. Sure, I yeah. I heard he got drunk with some of the guys in Istanbul last month. Wandered out of the bar looking for a fight. They found him the next morning covered in blood. What? Yeah. Stan thinks he killed someone. Read a newspaper article the next day. Istanbul police found some guy cut to ribbons just a couple of blocks from the bar they were at. Whoa. And I think we should try and get on his PC at the executive offices. See if we can find him. The code to the area is 2346, but I don't know the code for his actual office. All right. Well, if I find out what it is, we'll go together. All right.
here so late, we need to put some extra men on the Zerkazy detail. Your name, kid. Zerkazy? The wacko in the penthouse uptown? Well, it's perhaps best not to refer to our client as the wacko, but yes, him. Or rather, his penthouse. Milos Nowak is, uh... Who? Mylon. Mylon Nedich. Crazy Slavic names. I always get them confused. Anyway, Zerkazy is out of town, so there won't be a VIP, just the property. Okay. Sounds like a breeze. Well, it hasn't gone perfectly smooth so far. You'll get the full VIP rate, and you'll be on duty as though there is a package on site. Okay, got it. Good. You report at 1300 tomorrow. Okay, I'll be there. Good grab, Fisher. Mylon Nedich's real name? Jesus. Milos Nowak. Milos Nowak? Who is he? The Barber of Bosnia. Suspected war criminal from the Bosnian conflict. Allegedly scalped some of his prisoners. Wanted in The Hague? Yeah. Bet you dollars the dinars that he doesn't make it to trial. That's okay. I think my money's safer on the Nikkei. Nice suit. Italian? No! Oh, oh no! Ah, oh, Italian. Yes, the Florentine silk. Andretti? Who's Andretti? Andretti? The famous designer. Men's suits, tuxedos. I'm not a tuxedo kind of guy. But, but you are some kind of spy. Yeah, I'm the real kind. Not the tuxedo kind. I'm the kind of spy who gets blood all over your Andretti unless you give me information. Oh, God! Please, don't ruin my suit. How about a door code? CEO's office, 2609. My wife will kill me if I ruin this suit. You're wrinkling the fabric, please. Hokkaido. Hokkaido? Isn't that basically the Alaska of Japan? Yeah. Looks like Mylon Nedich has secretly relocated Zerkezi there. Interesting. Now we definitely need to talk to Shetland. We'll let State Department handle that mess. You're going to Hokkaido. We're sending a helicopter to evac you from the roof. <laughs> 